I mean, that's Blanc for as wild of a character mm -hmm. as it gets. Pun intended. I gotta say, my pun game feels a bit off tonight. It could be that it's... I mean, it's later for you. It's 1230, but, it, you know, it's 1030 at night. I've been working all day in the salt mines. All right, so we are going to see Ed versus Revilo. Now, Revilo played Ed for a while in his Street Fighter V career, so I'm interested to see how he deals with this matchup. Um, his uh, character path was actually Bison and Ed, I believe, up until Re Zeku came out, and then the Zeku switch happened right away. So, I just remember Shadow always played Mika before Ed. That's right. That's that's um, a, that's an impressive switch because Mika's definitely a better character than Ed. Yeah, I know. <laughs> I mean, I don't know how much Ed experience Shadow Ace has. There's a lot of Eds on the East Coast, like online, but the true experience, I'm not so sure about that. Yeah. He did. There was um, an exhibition. I think it was like first seven, first to ten against a DR Ed he played, and he ended up losing, but it was kind of close. So he has some experience for sure. Do you mean Zeku or? Again, Zeku. Sorry, okay. yes, oh, no again, Zeku. Yeah, I'm trying to think of like what Zekus we have enter like the East Coast RSF tournament, and I know there's one or two, but they they don't come through very often. I know there's like Destiny, and like that's about it. Yeah, I think that's the one I was thinking of. Wow, that was a low forward. Gonna cast out with V Trigger two, spend bar. Nope, saves it. It goes for the. I, I like that you know empty jump throw, but Shadow has seen that before. Yep. Here comes Blasty. I don't know. I like this patience from Zeku, just not wanting to get clipped by anything. You know if Shadow Ace can yeah. get a touch, he's going to cash out. <gasps> Yo! Ferret's in bounds. Welcome, Welcome to Mink Madness, baby. Mink Madness all day. The <laughs> Ferret Fury. Ferret the Fury. The wacky weasel. I like that from Tesla, because Deviant weaseled. I like that. DP and through knowing that. It's gonna happen. Yep, knowing he's gonna continue that string, right? And there's it's a there's a gap there. Good DP. I don't know what type of confirmed Charles is making. Maybe I didn't have much choices there. Oh, I like that little cheeky side switch from Shadow Ace. Oh, what a shimmy. Mm -hmm. Young Zeku is so good at that. Okay, I like that DP on the reset. Like, I don't want to hold this resetty. Get thrown. One more touch. He wakes up teching and gets the back throw for himself. Hey, don't really see old man Zeku do much back throws. <gasps> the he dropped it. Feature. He dropped it. That was supposed to be an EX run. EX run slide. Sorry, I got excited after you got excited. What were you saying? <laughs> oh, no, it was good. I was just saying that it was such a sick choice to do V, v Trigger 2. To get through the v, uh, the fireball there, yep. and that's that's actually how Revilo beat Samurai at WNF last week. Anytime he would do anything into red fireball, anything into a fireball, that V trigger came out, and he got big damage and follow up. Yeah, so Revilo definitely looks like a guy that has his reactions game down. Good challenge from Shadow Ace. Ooh, the palm strike pulling back that hurt box. <gasps> he just let it oh, rip. Punch. Yes, an optimal punish there by Shadow Ace. Yeah, if you're an Ed player at this level, you've got those punishes. On lock, gets clipped by the V trigger. OTG into the stun. This should be dead. Shadow Ace. And that was a legit confirm right there. Off the V trigger. Yep. Oof. Let's see. I mean, it's gonna need another round here if he wants to tie up the series. But man, Revel Oliver is looking so strong. Full meters. Okay. Yep. DP the cross under. I like that. Has not been blocked so far in this set yet. Oh no, a bad confirm! He's gonna get good damage. Oh, but he puts himself in the corner! He tries to bait an EXDP or something. Tries to flip nope. out, gets, gets flickered. This is tough. 
that flicker is covering so much space, it wasn't letting Revilo out of the corner. Good stuff from Shadow Ace. Yeah, good stuff indeed. Like, I don't know if that's intentional to, like, stop the, the Bushin flips, but looked like it because that was definitely several times in a row. Yep. It's tough, too, because I think if Revilo would have... He had to stance switch to get into Young's that could do the wall jump, right? So that was his only mm. way out were those flips or, or holding up forward. Or, you know, just trying to walk himself out. Counter hit confirms that's what you want to see. Yeah, but not closing it out. But now we got makeshift throw loops coming on. Anti-air Hosantos. I know that's that's the mark of a good Seku player, being able to anti-air with like Hosanto. Okay, he gets clipped, takes a throw, blocks it out, takes a throw again. View reversal, gets caught by the V-Trigger. Even though he got caught by the V-Trigger, that wasn't really that much damage, and Rebel yeah. will take that any day. Yeah, and then this time the Flicker poorly spaced by Shadow Ace, and Revealer able to jump it and get the punish and kill. No, I haven't. Ever, I, don't, I can't recall seeing Shadow Ace pick V Trigger too. I think it's a pretty good V Trigger, but definitely has a, an affinity towards V Trigger one. This is something I need to work on as a commentator. But I'm V Trigger two is the uh, the one that has like the extra block strings, right? With like the snatcher stuff. Yeah. Yeah. yeah it's like super plus. It's like super good pressure. Oh. The only weak is that you can be reverse out of it. Yeah. Oh yeah, that's right. Because he's using the orb. Duh. Come on, Tom. Get them. He says Weasel Madness, here we go. There's the bait, getting you to jump the Weasel. Spends the bar to get corner carry. Back throw. One more touch is going to do it for Revilo. Triple dash. Bird coming. Here's Mr. Mister Boomy. Okay. Mick Madness is not enough here. But anything will take it for Revel. Yeah, he just wants a touch. But, I mean, honestly, Shadow Ace is one touch away as well. Revilo barely has any life. He baited it with the run! Oh my goodness! He recovered just in time. Shadow Ace had the right idea, but just hit it a bit late. Yeah, a bit late, but man, that was such a perfect bait and catch there by Rebel. He's looking very strong. You're right. This is, I like, I'm really enjoying this Zeku. Yeah, seeing how far Revealo's come as a player has right. been super fun in the last, like, two to three years. Um, I wish we could travel. I would love to see the damage he'd be doing at Majors right now. Good anti-air DP. You know, that's the beauty with, with everybody's own fighting game community. It's like seeing your own players grow, taking them out and all that, and just seeing what the, how they do. It's just such a beautiful thing. Yep. Wow, wakes up, gets the counter hit combo, takes Shadow Ace to the corner, good tech. Revealer's been going to that throw a lot in that situation. No anti there. There could have been a light Hosanto spacing. Oh, he's, he's in... gonna get anti. No, he's not. Okay, the air to air from Shadow Ace. Now he's got big pressure coming. A big damage there as he was that side switch was kind of tricky. Got to be careful if he gets touched. He's stunned. That anti aired DP. Oh. And what the? Oh. Okay, so he he beats the store. What doesn't Young Seku Stampers do? Apparently, <laughs> right? everything. It shimmies, it anti airs, definitely does damage. <laughs> Two dashes to start the round off. Definitely whiff punishes. Yeah, it does everything. It's, it's the multi tool. I bet it opens cans, makes fries. <laughs> Good okay, it has its own air fryer in it and all that. <laughs> yeah, you're right. Dude, shout outs to air fryers. One of the best inventions ever. I, we don't have one yet, and I'm, I see these deals, I need to get one. Dude, they're, they make everything super crispy. Speaking of which, these links are crispy from Revilo. He's going for the setup! And that definitely puts you in a few guessing situations there. I, Shadow is probably has never seen that little situation. Good anti-air. Gets the corner switch, too. Is, is Shadow is going to DP? He wakes up super! Revilo baited it with a jab, though! <gasps> and he doesn't punish! Oh my god. Revilo's gonna be kicking himself in the butt if he loses this. Plus frames. He just needs a touch. Just one touch. <gasps> but so does Shadow Ace now! There's the punish on the minus four. That was close and terrifying. 
That was almost very, very bad. Yeah. <laughs> For Revilo, like, that could have been super sad, sad boys time. Right, and, and like, I mean, granted, he wouldn't have lost the match. Like, he wouldn't have lost the set for it, but, like, okay. Double reset. He walks under. Shadow is super aware of these mix-up situations. I wake up crouching medium kick to know that he was going to try to beat up Oh there. Yeah. That's a new buff to Zeku, too. The old man Zeku getting crouching medium kick cancel. Yep. Okay. Revilo on the meter disadvantage, but he's got the corner. Shadow is getting these air-to-air -air lights consistently. Oh, we tried to enter a jab, it was just not good enough. Reveal's gotta be careful, if he gets touched, he's dead. And Shadow is just so good at confirming the critical art. Yeah, you can't jump! Is he gonna cash out? And that'll do it! Revealo takes the set! Yeah, very convincing play by Revealo. This man using all the tools of two characters in one. That's why he's in Grand Finals. Yeah, gonna move right along, sending Shadow Ace down to losers finals. And now, friends, enemies, frenemies, party animals, whatever you may be, it's time it's time for another Blanca Mirror. Hope you're ready to go. This is gonna be interesting to me this might be the most exciting one because we have What's his face? We got Samskis, you know, he's been playing with this unstoppable object I'm kind of curious to see how Blanca is electric can stop that it's just been so strong tonight yeah it's been absolutely strong and I think in our community at this point I would have to say these are the two polar opposite Blancas right like they're the different ones um, they play different game they think differently and they're going in